Hey everybody, it's Christopher here with Radio Gaming, and today I will be playing a Nintendo Switch game for you. This is called Thunderpaw, and I have yet to try this. This is the first time I've taken a look at this game, so we're going to go ahead and experience this for the first time together. Thunderpaw, as described by the developer, Thunder was out playing with his, his ball in the fields when he suddenly heard a loud explosion near his house. He rushed home, worried about his parents, only to find no one was there. So let's go ahead and see what happened to his family. Oh, look at a little puppy there, Thunder. And a mini nuclear explosion at his house. So there's an explosion at the house, yet a letter was left there. Thunderpaw for the Nintendo Switch. 
I'll post a link in the description when we take a look at this game a little bit more. But it's a fun game. The controls are nice on it. Their graphics are fine. It's that it uses pixel art graphics, which are increasingly common with indie, uh, indie titles, especially on the Switch. But overall, fun game. Um, I mean, it's inexpensive, so it's worth a couple bucks to play it. Uh, I played through three levels there. There's over 20 different levels um, to explore in this game. So it's got a little bit of decent time to it. So give it a look. Let me know what you guys think. If you like it, great. If you don't, well, at least you saw something new for a little bit. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have a great day. And I'll see you guys around later. Bye.